Well guys, welcome back to another episode here of Slime and Slay Outdoors. It is a beautiful, cool Saturday mid-morning here. I just got out on the water, was uh, wishing I could be out earlier. I'm just not feeling the best, but uh, nonetheless, I wanted to get out on the water, just got like a head cold. But uh, the fish I know are gonna be biting here today, hopefully. Um, overcast conditions, we actually got a moon phase in about two hours, so that should be good. Um, water temps, as you can tell, are 63 and a half right here. I did see 62-ish by the landing, but uh, I'm excited. Got a coat on, it was 49 degrees here at about 9.30. So uh, yeah, definitely gonna be a cool afternoon here. Water temps have been climbing down and we've got some more cooler weather coming. So turnover is not too far away, but uh, I know what I like to do before turnover and that's throw some top water and get super shallow. So kind of seems to be a pattern always in September for me. So we're out here today. Hopefully you can make it all a decent time with this head cold uh, before I start feeling cruddy again. But um, yeah, I guess let's get to, let's get up to our first spot here and let's get to cast and stick with us. Hopefully we can stick one here today. All right guys, I have made it from my first spot here. Just a weedy shoreline here. And uh, as you can tell, I'm going to start out with some top water here today. A little fat bastard here by Lake X Lures. And uh, I'm excited. Like I said, hopefully we can get a top water muskie here today. Water temps here looks like about 62, but uh, 63 is kind of what we had. So got some cooler water temps. Like I said, we're getting close to turnover. So I love, putting on the top waters that time of the year. So we're gonna get to casting here. Hopefully we can stick a muskie, but uh, super excited to hopefully, um, super excited at least to be out here casting with this stupid head cold that I got. So, all right, that top water sure sounds good. Here he comes. Oh, not a big one, but we got one. That was cool. He hammered it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> gotcha, buddy. Oh, no. I think I got gotcha. you. You, but my bag's all wrapped up. <laughs> Little guy in the net. Cool. <clears throat> it's been a bit here. Nothing here this morning. Um, probably right getting our major, but that was super sick. Look at that top water. Just crunched. Yum, yum, yummy. 
That was cool. He definitely hammered it. Like he didn't slurp it in. It was a full kawoosh in like that. So, all right. Not feeling the best, but we stuck one. So get them on pin. All right, guys, we scored here and uh, no action up to this point. And we're entering our major right now. So that's kind of interesting, but uh, overcast conditions, late September, water temp is dropping drastically now. We've had nothing but highs in the 50s here this week. It seems like and lows have been actually hitting the frost point finally. And uh, definitely not feeling the best, but uh, I couldn't resist. I had to get out here and fish with this good September bite here. We'll show them what I got them on, but let's lift them in here. And uh, not definitely not a giant, but he's a healthy Wisconsin muskie here. All right. Look at that guy. Sweetness. What a absolute beauty. All right, get him on the bump board quick. And he is a three, he is a three footer. Look at that. Oh yes, Wisconsin three footer. All right, let's let him go. Where is my camera? Right here. Three footer, what a beauty. He's pretty much ready to go because these water temps are very cool. It's 62 degree water temps. And that's what I figured. <laughs> All right. Nothing better than a slime stash to make me feel a little bit better. Just dealing with the cold here. Not that that means anything, but uh, Waked up and she clobbered it. I mean, I knew right away. Sometimes you know how you can see them like nip the back end and kind of push the bait. This one was coming at it and literally it like kind of got boom and just turned on the side and quick grabbed it. But uh, I actually had to cut hooks and it's interesting. The back one was in her a little bit, but the whole front one was in her real good. Not in the gills or anything, but it was poking through every side and one was down in the tongue. And so we just cut the hooks to get her out easy and not keep thrashing around in the net, but uh, sweetness, overcast conditions, like I said earlier, and uh, we scored here. Like I said, water temps are 63 degrees right here. I've seen 62, and what better to not throw than a good old fat bastard top water. So let's get back after it here. I gotta get a new hook on, and uh, hopefully we can score another muskie here. Nice, 12, 20 muskie right now. All right, let's get back after it. Well guys, that's gonna wrap it up here. Um, probably we'll get back out fishing maybe this afternoon, a little bit later. Um, it is basically two o'clock and uh, I'm kinda hungry, but uh, just wouldn't mind to take a little bit of break, like I said, with the head cold I got. But uh, can't complain, still got the one fish and the feeding windows, like I said, are gonna start getting a little bit shorter. So sometimes you can really get on them like that and uh, sometimes they are still feeding most of the day, but we just got the one, it was right during the moon. And we still got another moon phase here later this evening. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a like, subscribe, and uh, best of luck to everybody out there that's uh, going to be doing some late fall musky fishing. So we'll see you on the next episode.